Experts urge pet owners to talk with their vets regarding finding the right tick and flea prevention strategy for their animals. Some products exist to help protect pets from parasites like fleas, ticks, and mosquitoes that may transmit the disease-causing organisms. However, they are not for use on humans. They contain chemical agents that work to repel the pests as well as kill them. Some examples of products available include Canine Advantix 2, a once-a-month topical application for dogs and puppies that repels and kills ticks, fleas, and mosquitoes. The product contains imidacloprid, permethrin, and pyroproxifen that work in concert to repel and kill parasites that could potentially transmit disease-causing organisms. This product is used for dogs only. Another option is a long-lasting eight-month product called Soresto, which is available for dogs or cats. Soresto not only kills ticks, but also repels them. If ticks are repelled, they cannot attach and feed on a dog or cat and transmit the organisms that may cause diseases. Sarah Laidler has strived to protect her family's pet cats from the abundance of ticks that live in the woods around their home in Wakefield, Rhode Island. I guess I'm concerned because it does affect my behavior. Sarah's family regularly mows the lawn around the home. Their cats are regularly treated with a tick preventive. Sarah checks them for ticks at least once a day. It's a part of our routine. We, we make sure that we're on top of it. And taking those simple steps, I think, can make it so you at least can say at the end of the day, well, I tried my best. I mean, it's, it's, it's the best you can do. And the personal things that you can do include protecting your pets, making sure that they're treated with a good flea and tick preventive. Products can offer consistent and timely pest control, are easy to apply, and relatively inexpensive. Some of the products that are out on the market are very good for killing fleas, but they don't necessarily kill ticks. So everybody should be encouraged to read the label. Researchers are also watching for new vector-borne diseases. There's always seems to be new things coming along when you talk about ticks and, and tick-transmitted infections. I'm sure that five years from now we'll have even more tick-transmitted infections that we're concerned about. As new vector-borne diseases emerge, it will be important for clinicians to adhere to the One Health strategy for the best results. But the bottom line is, preventing the threat of dangerous parasites is an all-year-round affair. Use products that are effective to keep ticks and fleas off your pet no matter where you live in the United States.